Hello? Shh. Lower your voice, please. Where should I look for the missing books? Maybe you should start at the beginning. Have you tried the children's corner? What books am I looking for exactly? One is supposed to be a teacher's edition textbook, but I doubt there are any valuable lessons in there. The other is a lurid crime story. Ugh, terrible books. The sooner we get them in isolation, the better. Can I talk to that nice writer, Cassie, again? You don't want to talk to her. She seems harmless, but she's full of dangerous ideas about human potential. Why do you want to round up these books? Because I'm the only one around here who cares about safety. I care. Great. The other Cassies had their chance to run things, and everybody got hurt. How did everybody get hurt? We all went to fight Maligula. And guess which motivational speaker thought she could talk sense into that monster? Ridiculous! It just made her mad, made things worse. So now, I'm in charge, and I keep all the books in order. All the important books. No offense. But I think you're running too tight a ship here. You can't keep people prisoner. Better to lock up a few books than have the entire library destroyed. I gotta run. No running in the library. This librarian aspect of Cassie's mind seems to have her whole psyche on lockdown. Until I figure out a plan, I'll play along with her scheme to avoid suspicion. <laughs> Hey, can you help me find these books? I'm her favorite assistant and best assistant, and I already looked, so give it up. Not a child. No. Well, this shouldn't take too long. Sensors know when something's wrong. Kill the thoughts that don't belong. Seriously? Some 
real damage. Have you seen any runaway books? Uh, sorry. Smarts ain't my thing. Hi! Memento Mori! Okay. your name? Guten Tag. Ich bin Gerda, the Pretzelmeister's daughter. Oh, where's the Pretzelmeister? Papa fell into the pretzel machine. Oh, gosh. I'm so sorry. Not to worry. It was his secret wish. Really? I think so. That's why I pushed him. Yep. Hmm. There's a narrow slot that I don't think I can fit through. Watch out! There's a giant... uh... you... out there hunting for... you! Don't worry, young man. The librarian can't get in here. That's why she sends in her... operatives. Who, me? I'm not an operative. I'm just playing along with her until I find the real Cassie. The real Cassie? Tell me, child. What is your name? Rasputin. And tell me... Who is the real Rasputin? The one you are with your friends? With your family? Or the one you say for your special someone? Hmm? Is that the real you? Or are you actually a combination of all those different identities? Important challenges in our lives can cause us to create entirely new identities for ourselves. Sometimes summoning powerful archetypes from our unconscious mind. The hero, the explorer, the shadow. 
My special talent allows me to summon up whatever archetype I need to survive my current situation. Would you like me to teach you how? Focus your mind's eye on a vision. The archetype you need most right now. Is it a trickster? A wise mentor? Hmm. There's or a narrow maybe. slot. I don't think I can Try fit again. through it. Doesn't always happen right away. Give me! Oh, well, very good. Woohoo! You'll get better with practice. Archetype will act on its own sometimes, but you can also focus it on a specific task. Hey! Not now! I'm working! Look, I think if I use the projection go. on this so door, cute. my archetype would go in there. That's the spirit! What a good boy! See where hey, this little fellow takes you. I'll meet you at the end, and then I'll tell you my plan for the librarian. Hey, I know you. Aren't you from The Mind and Introduction? Yes, yes. Always nice to meet a fan. No time for autographs, though. Sorry. Wow. Conceited. Please excuse me. I have a lot of thinking to do. Hi there. Lub dub. What was that? Lub dub. Lub dub. Lub dub. Uh. Lub. Why so glum, Dino Chum? Well, I'm from an old textbook, and it turns out I'm not considered a real dinosaur anymore. Please don't tell the librarian. She'll throw my whole book out. <laughs> my dogs are barking. Excuse me. Sure, sure. You just don't, don't you just love guy. books? Yes, <laughs> they're delicious. Hey. Maybe you should try reading books instead of eating them. Read books? What is that, some no fad diet? Oy. Sounds like a good way to starve to death. Excuse me? Yes? Are you in pain? To be free of the flesh is to be free of pain, my child. How did you lose your skin? I donated my body to medical science. I had no idea this is what they had in mind. Yikes. Are you mad about it? Skin's actually a lot more trouble than it's worth, to be honest. I'm free of rashes, itching, pimples. Aren't you cold? Cold is a feeling of the flesh, my friend. No skin, no cold. You look like you could teach me a lot about anatomy. You bet. How's this for starters? There's one of me inside of you. Gross. Hey, that's insensitive. Why aren't you, like, dripping blood and stuff? It happens from time to time, but I just go over to the horror books and drip on them. They like it. Bye, muscle man. Bye, baggy old clothes boy. Don't you just love books? Yes, yeah, they're delicious. Ah! Baby, ah! Through the door like a pesky pill. Oh, it's a mess. 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 Oh, it's a mess.
No effect. Protected by that enabler. No, no. Formula four. Sine waves. Hey, are you the formula for a general conical surface? No. I just clenched my belt too tight. Hard to breathe. Nice try, but I'm covalently bonded, sucker. <laughs> I think I hear some emotional baggage here. There's some emotional baggage nearby.
made it! He helped! Seeing you two work together so well really inspired me. And it gave me an idea. We need to get all of Cassie's archetypes together, round up all the runaway books, and give them to the librarian. But she'll lock you all up. Oh, don't worry. We won't be in them. We'll be with you. Now, go find the others. Hurry! Ah, the teacher's edition. We all learned so much from this one, but... We can't have her making up new identities and confusing things right when I'm getting everything sorted. Can we? No, we can't. Just one more book to go. You're right on the edge of becoming my favorite assistant. The battle with Malika must have brought this librarian to power to make Cassie feel safe. I think I should help Cassie get her aspects back in balance. My improved projection abilities don't go to my archetype's head. Shakespeare? Forsooth, etc. Oh, wow. 
You really talk that way. No, I just like to give the fans what they want. Bizarre. Don't really talk that way. Oh, sorry, I. They talk like this. Arr! Jinxed it. Here. But be careful. This is the shop of Fanny Flats, the famous counterfeiter. Cassie works for a counterfeiter? I work for myself, but I do what I need to survive. After our parents dumped us here, we needed an archetype that was a little more thick skinned. Cassie, we've come to bust you out. Did someone say bust? What was that? Huh? Shh! Never say bust in here too loudly. But it's true. We have a plan. Oh, hey, Teach. Listen, now's not a really good time. Flats has a big deal coming up, and she's really on edge. And I'm working on my ticket out of here. Can we help? Listen, don't tell anyone, but the cops are closing in on this place. The boss's days are numbered. I cut an immunity deal for myself. I just need to get them some evidence they can use against the big gal. But she's watching everybody like a hawk these days, and I can't get away. We'll do it. I'll get the evidence you need, and we'll b we'll briskly walk out of here together. Okay? Deal. But remember, never double cross a double crosser. Okay. I need three pieces of evidence. Better split up. Wait, who am I talking to?
Smell some ripe evidence nearby. Better investigate. Easy squeezy. These things are murder on my back. Looks fishy. Better take it as evidence. I think that's the best evidence I'll find in this part of town. I should check out the other I'll take it. more but we got full
anything until I get rid of <laughs> Can't handle your energy right now. Let's see how tough everybody is now. Ow! Looks like those guys just went out of print. Wait, what am I doing? Oh yeah, collecting evidence. I've got to stop saying that so loudly. Yeah. Oh, yep. Looks incriminating. Just one more piece of evidence to find.
is clean. For a fish market, I mean. But just dirty enough to have some juicy evidence, I'll bet. And this will make you smarter. Carp seasoning. Terribly old and rotten fish here. We fish for a healthy brain. Carp for pets. Fishy fish. And by fishing, I mean its freshness is suspect. Ah. My catfish is buttery and sweet and easy to eat. But they have a name yet. Catfish. Collar. Also have carp accessories, carp sweaters, carp leashes. Fermented fish, packs a punch. Carp that looks like octopus. Fish that's past its prime. For your cookout. Fish with worms. I don't eat carp. Carp is garbage fish. Come get your carp. Stinky fish. Come get your catfish. Carp poetry. We go. Day old catfish is even better for you. Silver carp, big head carp, black.
this looks like evidence of something. I think that's all the evidence Cassie needs. The evidence I need. Better bring it back to Cassie quick. Wow, this carving is beautiful. Why, thank you. We would have done more, but we got full. That's all the evidence we could get. Think it's enough? Let me be the judge of that. Oh, yeah. This is some hot dirt right here. We'll be able to blackmail her with this for years. Blackmail? I thought you were going to arrest her. What? How's she gonna make the money she needs to pay us from jail? But if she's not locked up and she finds out I was the one who sent her up the river... Hey, don't worry. We'll, uh, protect you or something. Let's beat it. This was a bust! What? Bust? Ah, it's a bust! Ah. Ah. Ew. Not a chapter of which I am particularly proud. Hey, she was forced into the outlaw life. Not that part. I just meant... Nobody likes a snitch. There you are, all safe and sound again. Thank you, young man. You were a little loud for my liking, but you got the job done. And now you'll help me with those bees? Oh, are you scared of bees? Well, I know of one place where you'll feel completely safe. Hey! Put me down! Of all the double-crossing... This was all part of the plan. It was? Yup. And I thought I was the tricky one. Oh my, we've come to a bad place. No, it's perfect. How is it perfect? Any place is perfect. When we're all together. Well, I haven't seen you in a while. We should never have let her split us up. When we're together, nothing is impossible. Well, that tears it. I hate to damage a book, of course. But that last line was too corny, even for a motivational speaker. We're not going to let you control us anymore. Oh. And which one of you thinks you should be in charge? None of you could stop Maligula. None of you could protect your friends. I am the real Cassiopeia. And I'll show you how we fight off a foreign invader. Ready for the shushing of your life! Ah! Help me out here, will you? Having a bad day. Throwing things? In a library? Believe in your friend, I'd like to borrow some... some words from my store in my head. Once you've read my book, there is nothing you can't accomplish! Mm. Now what did that poor little thing ever do to you? Let's have good through that! What was that? That was uncool! 
That's a little cleaner. Still, don't you know the library is a quiet place? Oh, I feel a little dog eared. Oh, Raz! Get that gate open so I can work on her from the inside! My cue, let me in there. I'll see if I can write a better ending to this story. What's going on? Who's in here? Hello, Cassie. You? The self-righteous little writer? What are you doing in here? We writers are most effective when we get inside someone's head. Again. I'm doing the have you no know, respect for private property. No, of course you don't. I think what mine swore would say about this situation. I almost wish I could feel that. Just out of curiosity.
Get that gate open, kid, and I'll bust this whole crooked operation. Ah, it's you! Okay, time for the money maker. Oh no. No, no, no. Something's not right. In fact, you could say something stinks. You! Oh no. I can't handle all three of you at once. That's kind of the point. Ready, gals? I'm ready. Together now! believe I failed again I guess I guess I'm not the real Cassie yes you are and so am I me too mostly when we need money hey I'm pretty good in a fight you might have noticed Are you the real Cassie? Hmm, not sure. But I'm sure she's in here somewhere. Now then, did you say something about my bees? Oh my, they really aren't behaving, are they? That's it. I'm all out of bee puns, I promise. Think you can do something about them? I'll try, but I feel like I've lost a little control of them. Oh, how I wish my old partner were here. I think they just need a nap. Oh, bully! How did you know I needed you? A little bird told me. Oh, sorry, I should say three little bees. Well then, think we can get this swarm to stand down? I do. Bedtime for bees. So, how's production? Jars of honey and no one to give it to. Come on. Okay, scary part's done. Now I just have to get rid of those vines somehow. No pins for that special projection in your life. that Psychor with your card so you can rank up. Don't be a stranger. Still too tough to get through. 